Ivan Zoot and welcome into another video here at Jatai Academy, J-A-T-A-I dot net on the web. The place you have come to know and come to rely on for some of the best up-to-date, current and powerful information in the world of video-based beauty and barber industry education. I'm Ivan Zoot, I am Clipper Guy, and today we're talking about the big rinse. What we're talking about is the opportunity to be more, do more, give more, and as a result, ask for more. That's right, deliver more value, charge more money, and have clients happily give you more for your haircuts. And it's simple. I'm gonna offer you today one simple idea. It doesn't cost you any money. It doesn't require equipment that you don't have. It only takes a very small amount of time, but it's an example of an idea that if you are instituting a price increase, and we just had January 1, many people raise their haircut prices January 1, or you have my holiday, July 1, raise your haircut prices day in the USA. If you've got your eye on July and you're gonna be raising your price on July 1st, well, maybe a great idea is to institute a value added service like this in conjunction with a price increase because in that context, you can say, I'm giving more, doing more, being more, offering more, and of course, I'm asking for more and clients will be happy to give it to you. And what is more? More is the after haircut rinse. I figured this out a very, very long time ago in my own haircutting career. It was recommended and suggested to me as a novice haircutter, somebody who's looking for an edge, maybe when they were newer in the business and they were hoping to get better in the business. But here's the deal. You cut a guy's hair, 9.30 in the morning on a Tuesday. In his 2.30 meeting that afternoon with a little bit of hair down the back of his neck, you're no longer his favorite hair cutter. So what am I suggesting? The big rinse. I'm suggesting when you're done with the haircut, instead of saying, you're going to the gym, right? You're all good, see you later. Or I know you're going home to take a shower, but when you're done with the haircut, take the client back to the shampoo bowl and rinse the clippings, rinse their hair. I'm not talking about a shampoo. I'm not talking about a conditioning treatment. That's a different video. I'm talking about taking the client back to the shampoo bowl or spinning the chair and throwing it back if you have a sink at your station, turning on the warm water and simply rinsing all the tiny little clippings out of their hair. Towel dry, apply some styling product, shake their hand, thank them, rebook their next appointment, give them two business cards and ask for a referral, suggest and recommend professional take home hair care product, ring them up in the cash register, hand them their change, accept your generous gratuity, all the things we know to do every haircut every time, add one to the list, add the big rinse. Rinse them out when you're done and level up. Take your game to the next level, take the client experience to the next level, take your pricing to the next level. And you know who's gonna help you go there? Clipper Guy, that's me, and Jatai Academy. Thanks for watching. Clipperguy.com for more information, J-A-T-A-I dot net on the web to follow the Academy and never miss a video. Have a great day.